and welcome to Hitchcrafty. To add to the ever-growing collection of Pokemon crafts, this week's tutorial will show you how to make a standard Pokeball. I'll be covering all the Pokeballs I can make patterns for over time, and this is a great craft to start plush making as they're very easily made. Here's a list of everything you need. The minky I use is a 1.5mm polyester minky and I buy my fabric in bulk from AliExpress. Pause here if you need to. The pattern is available for free from my DeviantArt and my Pinterest. It's the second link in the description. All of my patterns scale to an A4 piece of paper. The first thing you need to do is take one of the red top sides and the red top middle and align the middle's longer straight edge to the straight edge on the side piece and sew them together along the longer width curve line. Repeat the same on the other side. Once done, align the middle black strip so it starts at the straight lines and sew it along the open edge of the red piece. The sewing line should end at the straight line so there's enough gap for the circle piece to be sewn in. Then take the button pieces and use black thread to sew the smaller piece to the larger white piece. I recommend once sewing around it to go back over the gaps you left for a more clean look. On the black circle, use a template to draw a circle guideline on the tracing side then flip over to the finish side and use this as a guideline to sew the button piece to the centre. For the bottom side, repeat what you did with the red side by joining each of the side pieces along the longer curved edges so both points are at the back and the straight lines are matched at the front. After that, begin joining the black circle piece to the gap of the red piece and the black strip, leaving the gap for the white at the bottom. When you reach the end of the sewing line, begin joining the white piece along where you left the gap with the straight lines. Once all of the circle is sewn in, begin joining the white piece around the black strip also. Leave enough gap to flip, then turn the plush upright and stuff it. Use an invisible stitch to close off the remaining gap. And that is how you make a Pokeball plushie. Make sure you leave a like, subscribe if you enjoyed the video, and comment down below on ideas like to see me make next. And while you're at it, why don't you go check out my other videos, I upload new videos every single week. Thanks for watching, bye!